name's Ken Dakin and um, I have been a programmer for more than 40 years and I'd like to talk to you today about spreadsheets. The generally recognised history of spreadsheets is that in 1979-80 Dan Bricklin and um, a colleague uh, created a spreadsheet for PCs called VisiCalc. Whilst that is in undoubtedly true. In fact, um, spreadsheets were uh, effectively invented uh, in their um, recognised state in 1974, six years earlier, on mainframes. Uh, I was a programmer working at ICI in Northwich um, and uh, Dr Robert Mays was the uh, analyst on a project called the Works Record System. Now the Works Record System was um, a generalised system um, which built up applications for holding the chemical works records and manipulating the uh, figures. Essentially um, the data from tank levels and so on were fed into uh, a 3270 type device, that's a visual display unit, and using um, al um, formula that were keyed in by the engineers, um, various statistics and cumulative figures were developed. Um, the application was completely built by the engineers, there was no programming involved whatsoever beyond the initial creation of the spreadsheet. It wasn't called a spreadsheet, it was called the works record system, but essentially it had rows, columns and formula. Um, notable was the fact that the formula could not be overwritten by data, they were held separately, and this is one of the most common problems of today's PC spreadsheets, the fact that um, the average data input clerk can overkey a formula in any part of the spreadsheet and cause it to be corrupt. That never happened with the original spreadsheet that uh, I was involved in. The whole system was written in IBM assembler language and uh, there were probably less than 10,000 lines of assembler code in all and very much built on control table um, techniques where instead of um, the assembler code being written to, to hold the logic, uh, all the logic was held in tables and effectively was therefore platform independent if it had been ported to another uh, system. The system ran for 27 years from, from 1974 to 2001 where it was superseded by some other system. Um, there were many many um, applications at ICI um, both in Northwich and worldwide that used this system. It was also used for trade union negotiations um, around about 1974 um, when the unions were quite strong and um, for, that, for that reason it had a low profile within the organisation but the directors used the system uh, to negotiate with the unions. Thank you.